this day, we the people of Ambazonia stand with the citizens in Mwabong village in the southern zone and with the people of Bafut. Bafut and Mwabong in our minds. We want to send a message to Yaoundé that this is an unwinnable war. The killing, the maiming of our people, the burning of our villages will not allow our people to submit under you. You cannot rule a people without their express authority. So we would want Cameroon to have these on record. You will never win Ambazonians. If you kill this generation, the next generation would fight on. If you kill the next generation, the next generation would fight on. If you kill that generation, the soil, our land, will fight for us. Cameroon, you will never win this war. That is a fact rooted in history. So do the right thing. Only negotiations and wars. Guns don't win wars. Pull out your army of occupation. Release all Ambazonians in your detention. All of them, without exception. And get into negotiations without any further delay. History is going to hold particularly Southern Cameroon elites who have conspired with the enemy to slaughter our people in their masses. The massacre is on. It's happening every day across Amazonia. Even at the time, the COVID-19 period, when the world's attention is turned to us, healing wounds and saving lives. Let it be known that every single one of you who has ignored the plight of the ordinary Amazonian child, mother, father, the pain of Amazonia over 60 years, that the blood of all our people slaughtered will be on your head. This is a conscience call to all Ambazonian elites listening to me, speaking on behalf of the masses of Ambazonian people who have suffered a lot over the last four years. It is time to turn a new page. It is time to do the right thing. It is time to use your voices and call on Yaoundé, call on Mr. Paul Beer to get to the table. Life is precious. Life must be saved. Only cannibals get into war. Let peace reign.